we are on our way to Germany. 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 Haiti. So we just picked up some snacks and we, now we have, I think, a two and a half hour drive through the mountains. The earthquake in August had a lot of damage in the mountains where, as you can see, it is no longer two lanes driving around the mountains. It has collapsed into where um, there was only one lane, half a lane. There were even some parts that there was no lane and they had actually make another part of a road come out to go around the um, debris. So if you look at Haiti on a map, we live in the lower part of the lower peninsula part of Haiti where Jeremy, where we're traveling to, is in the upper part of the lower peninsula of Haiti. The August earthquake actually damaged the main bridge, a suspension bridge that leads into Jeremy. So now you have to travel down a little bit and drive through a river. We stayed at this amazing place called Place Charmant and it is located at one of the most beautiful places in Haiti. It overlooks one of the most beautiful scenic spots I have ever seen in all of the places I have visited in the world. Betty and her husband own this place and they are such a sweet couple, so kind and welcoming. They were just so incredible. And so my friend knows them and so through my friend we were introduced to them and we all went and stayed there um, for the weekend together as with our families and had so much fun swimming in their pool and eating dinners together and playing games together and just enjoying and relaxing the time there. Uh, the, the space there is private and um, just beautiful big grassy areas and, and garden-like areas to walk around and so many beautiful scenic spots and the pool was so much fun. I think we swam in it a couple times every day. It actually made I <laughs> Micaiah's bucket list, he told me. I didn't even know this. He was like, Mom, one of my bucket list items came true. I was like, oh, okay. I didn't even know you had a bucket list. He goes, it was swimming in the pool at night. He goes, I've never done that before. And it was so amazing. And so we had such a wonderful time there. I could not recommend this place enough. So if you are ever in Jeremy, Haiti, make sure and check it out. You will not regret it. The August earthquake damaged the main bridge going into Haiti, and so now cars cannot go on it, but motos and people can still um, go and walk on it. And so they took us there um, one night, and it was really neat to walk across so you could actually visibly see the, the damage and um, the break in the bridge. Um, that just doesn't make it safe for cars to go across but it was really a neat experience to walk across with the kids and to see the beautiful river there. So this walking bridge that you're about to see, we heard from Betty, the owner of the hotel we're staying at. She was actually approached um, by a group um, to with funds to do something in Haiti and they wanted to know where, where was a big need and she shared with them about this community and how so many um, mothers that were in labor were having um, a lot of issues, medical issues, even, you know, babies passing away just because it was so hard to get across the river. Now in the video you're going to see the river, the river is pretty low that day, but um, it's usually much higher. And so this bridge has been such a blessing to the community to be able to not only motos go across um, to get places faster, but especially made 
for mothers in labor so that they can safely get to the place they need to be to deliver their babies. Okay, so I am out here waiting for them to get back um, across the bridge. I tried walking a little bit. <laughs> I just can't handle the swinging and um, the heights at the same time and knowing motos are coming across. So I am walking around out here and this like valley, I see cows and children playing and there's the river and then over here, this cool little hill and then there is the bridge right there. Are you having fun? Ziki made it, you guys will be fine. Oh, you went where Ziki went, it's deeper there. I'm going away. To the daddy. Look, look at these little puppies. Look at that. See? And we got the other one right here. Tying out in here. Can I pet him? Look at that puppy. <laughs> Uh -huh. Mango and avocado trees and flowers everywhere. There was so many beautiful things to look at on the grounds there at the hotel. Our final day in Jeremy, our friend took us to this beautiful beach and Jeremy that is actually a cove and it, it's private and it's beautiful and we had so much fun. The boys had a blast even though there was um, a lot of seaweed in the ocean um, while we were there and coming up on the beach which you know happens various times of the year. Um, we didn't mind it. The water was so warm and the boys had so much fun playing in the sand.
Wow, we had an awesome time. It was such an amazing mini little vacation and spending such great time with wonderful friends that means so much to us. It was so refreshing and we were so grateful to get away and have this time.